How to type. Whether you need to type a resume, a letter, or a bibliography, it can get done fast if you learn how to control the keys efficiently. You will need a keyboard or typewriter, patience, time to practice, and a computer with internet access. Step one, position your fingers on the keyboard. Put your little left finger on the A and your right little finger on the semicolon. Lay your fingers one at a time on each consecutive key and place your thumbs on the space bar. The F and J keys on most keyboards have small bumps to easily identify where your two pointer fingers should stay without having to look down. Step two, learn what fingers control which keys. The left index finger controls the F, G, R, T, 4, 5, V, and B. The left middle finger controls the D, E, 3, and C. The left ring finger controls the S, W, 2, and X. The left little finger controls the A, Q, 1, Z, and Shift. Step three, learn what keys the fingers on the right hand type. The fingers on the right hand control the same pattern of keys as you learned on the left side. Step four, press the space bar with your right thumb. Step five, master the shift keys with your little fingers. Press the shift key while simultaneously pressing the letter of choice to type a capital letter. If the letter is pressed by the right hand, use the left shift key and vice versa. Step six, sit up straight with both feet on the floor. Position your chair and keyboard so your arms are at a 90 degree angle and are parallel to your legs. Keep your elbows next to your body and your head straight. Try not to look down at the keys. Step seven, practice typing. You can learn for free online by visiting websites with touch typing tutorials. Learning the art of typing will save you tons of time over the hunt and peck method. Did you know? The letters on old typewriters used to be listed alphabetically. In the late 1800s, Christopher Latham Scholes rearranged the keys to prevent jamming.